Hey everyone, I'm Winter and this is a quick tip to a safe PVT build order inspired by Rain and pretty much copied from Rain just starting out Chrono boosting, getting a 13 gate, scouting around for proxies after that anywhere outside the base and then past this just going directly into a mothership core this is an important point making the zealot right off the bat making sure if your expansion is blocked you'll be able to take out the engineering bay uh, and then canceling the zealot at the last second when seeing it isn't blocked uh, at this point you've determined if, if he's going for a reaper first uh, by well you can scout him with your probe or you can use your observer early on I prefer to scout with a probe except on four player maps where I get a little bit greedier uh, and then just corner boosting out getting a mothership core first mothership core into second gas and then on a hundred gas after that getting a stalker and then on the first hundred gas getting a robotics facility usually around the five minute and fifteen second mark while corner boosting probes out assuming he's expanded uh, from this point, getting my forge right after when I have the minerals, and then a second gateway while making two observers. And then after the first century, the second gas at about 6.30 at the natural. After the first century, once you have 200 gas and 200 minerals, making a robotics bay to produce Colossus. And then the next 100 gas goes into plus one armor, so later on you'll have a lot of armor for those charge lots to really win the game. Pumping out an immortal so you're safe against early attacks, so getting the mothership core out early in order to defend once again against early attacks. But at this point, the observers are in position to scout if he's Dropping. If he is having the stalkers in the main while making the Colossus, just continue making Colossus until you see he's overproducing Vikings to deal with it. And then once he transitions into Vikings or a third base, taking a third base of my own, uh, going for a Twilight Council and upgrades. Usually getting the Twilight Council around the second or third Colossus. Uh, when you have the gas kicking in from both your expansions, but from here just taking a third base going to Templar off of eight gas uh, Continuing upgrades off of one forge until you feel safe enough to get two forges Which is pretty much when he's turtle up towards the third base and making sure you don't get dropped from any angle That's why ha to having the mothership core back in the main as well as ideally having observers or cannons outlining your all your all of your bases the replay uh, will be in the comments as well as the build order make sure to like and subscribe and tell me which quick tip I should do next